In this video, we're going to have a look at placing decimals on a number line. My number line starts at 0, 1 and ends at 2. Let's have a look at how many pieces, equal size pieces, I have divided the lines into. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There are 10 equal places between 0 and 1. Each one of those represents 1 tenth. Let's have a look at our first decimal. 0 0.2. We know that 0 0.2 is the same as 2 tenths. So with my number line, I can start here. 1, 2. 0 0.2 would appear here on the number line. Let's look at another one. Decimal 0 0.5. Start at 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 0 0.5 is halfway between 0 and 1. 0 0.8 is the same as 8 tenths. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 0 0.8 would be there on the number line. Let's have a look at this decimal now. Hmm. 1 decimal 3. I have 1 whole and 3 tenths. So here is 1, so I can start at the 1 whole and count 3 tenths. 1 tenth, 2 tenths. 3 tenths. 1 decimal 3 is here on the number line. Let's have a look at this one. 0 0.37. Hmm. Well, we've got no holes. I've got 3 tenths and 7 hundredths. So let's go to our number line, count three tenths, one, two, three, but I've also got seven hundredths, okay? If this line here was split into another ten, halfway would be about here, so it would be a little bit more, so 0 0.37 would be, it's a bit squishy there, somewhere between here on the number line, so it's closer to 0 0.4 that it's more than halfway between these two here. Okay. 1.85. So that's one whole, and we have to do eight tenths. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But we've also got five hundredths. So it's halfway between these. 0 0.85 would be there on the number line. 